so excited. I'm so excited. I cannot believe the trailer for Our Sky 2 has come out this fast. They're like still filming. Pond and Poon were literally on the set of Never Let Me Go yesterday. How is there a trailer already? I wasn't going to watch it though. For anyone new here, I have only seen four of the shows in this series is it is it even a series what even is it to be honest <laughs> i've only seen four of the shows which are never let me go my school president bad buddy and vice versa so i didn't want to get like spoilers for anything coming up because i do still plan on watching the other shows obviously i won't watch the ask episodes before i watch the shows but you know um but i've been told that it's not a proper trailer it's not coherent in any shape or form <laughs> so that's good to know um so i just thought i'd watch it and a few people had asked for a reaction as well so i thought you know i might as well treat myself and get a little insight into what we're in store for here ah i'm so scared but i'm so excited as well i'm nervous because it's the last time i'll be seeing these characters but i'm also so excited because i want to see them again but anyway the trailer is super short it's like a minute and 47 seconds let's just get into it i'm so excited <laughs> taking a shot every time i say that honestly oh. it's too fast this is this isn't why have they got tess and tan in here that's not necessary by the way <laughs> They're calling me out right there. I see me. This is too fast. I hate. I ah! I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. Why is it so fast? Oh no, it's too loud. Now, I have to speak my truth on this. I don't like the hair. But, but, I'll take it because he looks more like Pat in the novel. And I think that's what they were going for because Om literally cut his hair the day after they finished filming. So I guess they were growing out for that reason and I respect the honesty. Oh my god. They look so much like Pam Brando. I, I, ah. Oh. I feel like I could cry, honestly. When, <laughs> when I watched the first Ask IT trailer, I did cry, I'm not gonna lie, because I was just so shocked. But I'm not gonna cry today. <laughs> no, I'll save that for the episodes. Oh, I'm so happy we're getting them again, though. <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? What the hell? Why is Palm dressed like that? What on earth is going on? Was that Neo? Yes. That he's definitely in another series, right? That's that's not up from vice versa, surely. <laughs> okay. Right, I might just watch through without pausing for people that don't like pausing, and then I'll go through and pause it after. But I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. What is happening here? More chaotic than you think, yeah. I thought Gemini said there won't be a body swap. That looks like a body swap to me. That's the scene where Gunn was drunk and the student council came in. But Mark and Ford, or Two and Paul, are also swapped as well. So is it like a multiple body swap? I'm beginning to think these episodes won't be plot driven like I've been thinking. <laughs> At least everyone looks like they're having fun while they're doing it. Oh! Guarding glasses though! So sweet. <laughs> what the hell is going on? 
I love how everyone else is like running around having a nice time and then here's Pat and Fran just establishing that they are still horny devils. Good to know. Oh my god! Seaweed scene 2.0. What? That is defo getting sold somewhere in the near future. I'm calling it now. It looks very Nong Now esque though. Another elevator scene? What is going on with Barman Nung? He looks so much like Brad, honestly! Ah! Because I see so much Nanon stuff on the timeline nowadays. I was thinking like, he looks so different how he did in Bad Body, but how did he look like Fran again? It's a mystery to me, honestly. Okay, kind of did a death I a body swap. That's all I'm getting from this, really. I've ordered that t-shirt now. When Vice First was airing, I was debating on getting it so hard and I finally decided, you know, like nearly a year later, I love that for me. Um, Cause I wanted to have something to wear during that episode. Cause I obviously have my friend on friend t-shirt and I've also ordered some My School President merch. I'm scared for the air date of this actually because none of it's gonna come in time. <laughs> like that though <laughs> why are they like this why is Pratt on a table why does it look like they're in the the theater in the university like i have ptsd from that curtain scene i don't need to be seeing it again Nine. 19th of april what's the date today it's the 11th of April. It's next week. Are you serious? What day? Wednesday and Thursday! I'm pissed. I'm pissed. <laughs> no! <laughs> this is so awful for me. Oh, this, this, <laughs> this is not the reaction. People are probably excited that it's so soon, but I am so annoyed. I literally ordered the merch the other day, like three days ago, so I could wear them during the Ask episode. I was like, oh, they're filming now. It'll probably be like a couple months before it gets released. Next week? Are you freaking serious? Oh my God, no, the merch isn't gonna come in time. I've spent like a hundred pounds for nothing. <laughs> Because I can't hold off on the episodes. I can't not watch the episodes once they're out. Uh, oh, the posters are cool though. Mm. Well, okay, we'll, we'll talk about them last. The Eclipse, that looks very cool, I like that. Never Let Me Go, it just looks aesthetic outside. Star in my mind, they've got a star there. My school president, Gun and Tin are wearing opposite outfits. Well, I guess that's just their uniform. You know, but I, I'm I'm thinking that's a body swap. Vice versa, they're surrounded by pink. Now, these don't look like outfits that Pat and Pram would wear. I'm sorry, <laughs> but it's a nice touch adding the the cans, and then a, a Taylor Thousand Stars. That looks nothing like what I've seen of a Taylor Thousand Stars. Like all I've seen really is what they show. To be honest, that Earth wears like a khaki jumpsuit. A boss and a babe, I don't know anything about. Only the trailer, the pilot trailer. Yeah, I'm gonna watch it again. But I'm so pissed. Two episodes a week. How many are that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's eight weeks. A boss and a babe will be last because it's still airing. Oh, this is gonna be. Ah, oh, I don't know whether my merch is gonna be here in time. I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed. I thought this would be one of the last shows. I was like, right. This is the show I'm most excited for out of the 2023 lineup. I was like, that's gonna be last. Cause Never Let Me Go was my favorite last year. And that was one of the last to air. I was like, I've got a whole year to wait. I can watch all the shows before it airs. 
I've only watched half of them. I'm pissed. But anyway, I'm going back to watch it again. Also seeing oh what are they doing with a child? That's so cute. Seeing all the cast like having fun filming, because most of them are like behind the scenes tidbits I feel like. Seeing like the wholesomeness behind the camera really makes me want to watch these shows now. I have no idea what the plot is for any of them though. What is going on with you, Pam and Luke? They're just wearing brown in like every scene. I don't get it. <laughs> and that looks nothing like the eclipse from what I saw. <laughs> what is that? That's Jimmy and C, isn't it? What are they doing? Why are they all massaging each other? That looks like the theatre place as well. Wild theory. Oh my god. Are they witnessing Pam Pran on the table? <laughs> no, it's just how the gang finds out. <sighs> The eclipse is really intriguing me too. What is happening? Oh god, it is glasses! No! More romantic. Never Let Me Go looks like they're very like historical or something. It looks very old timey. Very period. My period is today. Pon's hair looks so old as well. It looks like it looks like um Palm and Nung are like doing not a body swap but like a role reversal. It looks like Palm is like the kingpin and Nung is almost his servant or something. Rock. I think it's just, there's two episodes each, so I wonder if they'll have like completely different, like if one of them will be completely crackhead with the whole swapping, role reversals, whatever's going on, and then one episode will be normal. Because <laughs> the eclipse, one minute it looks like they're doing like, I don't know, they're jumping about in yellow suits. And then the next minute, they're just sat here looking all cute like this, in darkness. Like, one, it looks normal one minute and then completely chaotic the next. ในอวสกายสองเริ่มตอนแรก 19 เมษายน No, look, I am excited. I am excited. I'm pissed about my merch. Perhaps not getting here in time. But I'm so, I am excited. Oh, it just feels like home. These are like the plot thing. Hmm. I don't know. It doesn't look like it's going to be very plot driven. I've I've been <laughs> while watching My School President. I've been having like so many theories about what could be happening in the Ask Guy episode. I'm like, oh, we're coming to an end soon, but at least we'll still have them in Ask Guy. Maybe we can see them go to college and stuff. No, I don't want to complain. We haven't even seen it yet. But for My School President, at least it looks like they're just redoing scenes that we've already seen, which I don't mind. I find that cute when like you see that in TV shows. But because this is the last time we're seeing them, I feel like we could, even if they were doing the body swap thing or role reverse or whatever it is, they could at least like show different scenes from each other's point of view, like still acting like gun and tin in the opposite body but doing different scenes or maybe they are doing that they're just showing us scenes that we know to like hint at what their plotline is about 
A lot of them, I can't really work it out. Never Let Me Go looks historical. Bad Buddies actually looks the most normal because the majority of their scenes, they did just look like they had to go to horny jail, but they're in their uni uniforms and like, they still look like they're acting like themselves and the gang's still there. Bad Buddies looks most normal. I, I didn't pay too much attention to the others, like a boss and a babe, I didn't really pay attention to. A Tale of Thousand Stars and Star in my mind. It's not because I dislike it or anything, it's just I haven't seen it, so I don't want to like watch it too much and get hints of the couple or what it's going to be about because I haven't even seen their shows. The Eclipse, it's quite hard to miss those ones, so those ones were like the wildest parts of the trailer, I feel like, because they're just out there in random outfits. What are they doing? <laughs> um, and then vice versa as well. To be honest, that looked just very vice versa they're out there just acting cute which is basically what all of vice versa was pretty much why i want loki in a way for narrative purposes is it would make sense if vice versa was first because that was set in parallel universes and then something happens in there that unlocks different multiverses or something and then we see each of these couples in a different world like doing whatever shit they're up to um, that would make narrative sense, but is it too much narrative sense for this silly little crackhead show? I don't know, but also I don't want Vice Versa to be first because my t-shirt definitely won't be here by next week. <laughs> Swings and roundabouts, I can't control it. I'll be here whenever the episodes drop for the shows I have seen. Apologies if I didn't fangirl too much over your favourite shit, but as I say, I've only seen half of them. I have a video that's going to be completely different to what I was expecting because I thought it would be like very, very much a continuation of their stories, but it looks like it's something completely separate, <laughs> which is interesting, which is not what I was expecting, but I'm here for it. We get to see the characters again. You love to see it. That's it for my reaction to the Ask Guide 2 trailer. Leave a like if you enjoyed and I will see you next time. Bye!